Good day, my friends in the fire service. I'm Brian Pods, and this is Ask TFT. Today's question from the fire service is this. We're trying to figure out what's the best, most cost-effective setup for our foam system because the new Class A and Class B foam concentrate isn't going through our foam pro system. We're looking at an eductor system. Our eductors are 40 plus years old. I'm looking for an eductor that will attach to the pump panel, then to inch and three quarter hose and ultimately to a nozzle. What are the options? Foam nozzle or aspirator? What size eductor, et cetera? Well, thanks for the question. Very common in the fire service. An external foam eductor will definitely help you deliver good quality finished foam. Foam eductors can easily be attached on the two and a half inch discharge of the truck or even in between any two lengths of hose with inch and a half or two and a half inch couplings. Eductors are available in 60, 95, or 125 GPM for handline operations and even 250 and 350 GPM flow ratings for portable monitor operations. The nozzle of choice can be fixed, selectable, or even an automatic fog nozzle, but it is imperative that the GPM rating of your chosen nozzle matches the flow rating of the eductor. If you choose an automatic nozzle, you don't have to worry about this because the nozzle will automatically adjust to the flow rate. A lower rated nozzle pressure of 75 PSI will always be an advantage because lower nozzle pressure equals lower stream velocity. So it's not going to strip away the foam bubbles as much as a 100 PSI nozzle. Last but not least, a foam attachment or aspirator, you called it, for the nozzle will entrain air and mechanically agitate the foam solution, which again will help you deliver the highest quality of finished foam. Thanks for the question today and keep them rolling in at tft.com contact.